Hi everybody, it's Debbie here. Welcome back to My Crafty Then. If you are new here, thank you very much for clicking on this video and deciding to watch today. And if you like what you see, maybe you could consider hitting the subscribe button as well and coming back to see what else I have on my channel. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for joining me today. I appreciate each and every single view. And so let's get on with today's video. Today I just have this little snippet and I would like to show you what I've done with my sideboard in my kitchen and how I'm using it for my coffee bar. So this sideboard belonged to my mother and it was my grandmother's before that. So it's third generation and has never been refinished and it's pretty banged up and it's had lots of love and lots of use. Um, yeah, so... I am going to paint this eventually when I get my china cabinet that goes with it out here. Both of them will be painted the same. And so for now, I'm using it as a coffee bar and I have it set up with just a few items on top. The glass jars are looking really pretty there with my coffee pods in. And of course, I've taken that the wreath off my front door and added it to the wall above the buffet because it just looks so pretty there. And it's, it's just the perfect size for there. So I have a few things set up on here. It doesn't have room for a lot of things, but first of all, I have my Keurig, then my coffee, and my husband's coffee, which is the decaf, so it's in a smaller container. He doesn't drink as much as I do. And this little setup is so cute. The stickers I ordered online because I don't have a Cricut, and I put that one on Cricut. I'll let you know if these things touch down, you can't get them back off. You just can't get them back off to straighten them. So, yeah, I had no trouble with the first one. The second one, I got crooked. I do have a little cutting mat from the dollar store here. I just place it down to keep coffee from and sugar and stuff from spilling onto the top of the buffet. I have my cups on the um, little cup tower there. And a cup tree. This little stand. Oh, yeah, this little stand I thrifted for under five dollars i have these little um plates there's two of them i'm i've used one it's in the sink but i just use them to plop an extra tea bag or to set a spoon on and i have these little spoons that i don't use for anything but my coffee and tea we don't use sugar so there's our splenda and look yeah, I'm cheating. I just turned my naughty sugar bowl around backwards. So, yeah, that's why it doesn't say anything on the front. And this is just creamer. So I buy the big creamer and then put it into the small container and keep it at the coffee bar so we can use it. We both like using Coffee Mate. So this is just a really functional, um, not completely decorative. And in the little drawer underneath it, my tea bag. And my Cocos, got to have the hot chocolate all year round, just a little bit. And I keep extra tea towels and, you know, for all my seasons, my decorative tea towels, they're all in here as well. It just seemed like a nice handy spot to keep them because there wasn't a lot in that drawer. So, yeah, this is what it looks like. Um, it's very functional. It's very pretty. It suits my kitchen. It's an eat-in kitchen, um, not very big, and it just needed an extra space. So that's what this is for. And it freed up all my counter space. Because my uh, microwave is on top of my counter right now, that was an extra space that um, that I, I don't have because the, the microwave's on the countertop. So I needed this spot to put the coffee bar. And yeah, so if you enjoy this little snippet, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment and share. And by all means, if you haven't already hit that subscribe button, go ahead and do that too. So yeah, come on back and see what I'm up to next. Um, 
I never know what I'm doing. So I can't tell you guys because I never know what I'm doing. So thanks very much for watching, everybody. Have a wonderful day. Stay safe and, uh, yeah, stay healthy. So bye-bye for now, everyone. See you in the next video.